express it, Lady Joshua. Yes. I'm locked on it. I say no more minute. This people have clean us. This people have killed us. Let's secure our community by our humble self. I block go road. Yeah, this is just a peaceful protest. Peaceful protest. We don't need military. Let military go in Umunochi, local government area, Abia State. Military should go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I was a lady. Okiwa Express Road. I ban and make kidnapping. They are Umunochi youth. After I came, I came. So, military should go. Let military go. Military should go. We are no longer comfortable with their services. Let military go in Umunochi, local government area, Abia State. I am at the use of Umunot, local government. I have put on the Kim so let's secure our humble self by ourselves. Military should go. Yes. Military should go. Military. We don't need military. Hello, great people. Great people of Biafra. My great people. Freedom fighters, lovers of freedom, my great people all over the world. You are welcome once again on IPOB Rapture Media under the leadership of Mazen Namdekano. My name is all Mazi Okin Naukechuku, known as Bia Franchi, the Wachineke, the general. My great people, I have back again today. This is what they call welcome development. What they call this is welcome development. Now you begin to see that our people are beginning to wake up. They are now understanding, they have already understood that one of our major problems are military. And do you know the worst part of it? That some of our people don't even understand who those people are. These people are disguising as a military. Why they are a full and full soldiers. I don't lie about what I'm saying. I always bring reality to our people. I always open the ears of our people so that they will begin to hear, so that they will understand the mess that we are into. They are chasing them out and they have to chase them out in totality. We don't need these people from Sahel. We don't need Fulani in our land. These people are Fulani's food soldiers. They are coming with conquest. They are coming with jihadists. They are Islamists slash terrorists i will keep on saying the way i will you see that is why i am here to tell our people what it's all about to tell our people who these people are should be in case if you don't know so you will begin to know them all of them from a to z go to fulani land go to alamadiri go to fulani land you will not see any roadblock you can never see any roadblock I have a friend that traveled from Mena to Joss. He was, you know, the car was just running, running. No, 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 no person stopping them. No, nobody, nobody, nobody. But then we leave the northern part of Nigeria where the insecurity is the, the is the, is the, I mean, is the talk of the day. Then we allow those people to be there and they now then we put them in uniform. P pushing them to come to our land at the same time begin to extort money from us listen to me my people let me tell you people something if you people don't know you know i always say things the way it is i always bring reality to my people i don't want to concoct any story i don't want to paint things for it to switch you i don't want i'm bringing it raw so that it will be entering into your ear and it will remain there that is why i'm here I'm not coming to say things because uh, uh, they will shut my page down. We don't care. We will tell you the way it is so that you will understand it. Listen to me. Let me tell you people something. You will see all these armies that you see every five, uh, every three kilometers, they have a road, uh, roadblock. Every three kilometers, they have roadblock. Even though also in rulers area in our place, they also have roadblock. Do you know the reason why? These people want to extort money from you people to be able 
to finance their agenda, which is conquest, which is ethnic cleansing. You see, they have already kidnapped one. Uh, is it? Is it uh, well, I don't know which uh, where his uh, his congregation is Methodist or I don't know or Baptist. The the the, the, the man they kidnapped. The pastor or priest, I don't know what they call themselves. Either from Methodist or Baptist. The man told you that one of them have leaked the secret. And that secret that that person leaked, it's not that he want to leak it. It's just a, a tip there is something. No, no. So that it will come from the father or the priest or the pastor. I don't know what the Baptist or Methodist call themselves. He want to come from that kind of person. You call man of God so that you people will believe it. Because somebody like me, if I say it, you will say it's a lie. Now you begin to see it. These people you see, they are in our land. They are just there to begin to extort money from our people, using the money for their mission, mission of conquest, to take over your land. And now you begin to understand it. You have to chase all of them away. Chase all. The, you see, this is what they call welcome development. We don't need military in our place. Our place is peaceful. We don't need them. We don't need any help from them. Because the one thing about them is they are not the real soldiers. They are just full and need food soldiers for conquest. Now you begin to understand it. Now I want you people to also see something. I want you people to look deep into this that I'm going to say now. You see how this protest is going on. You see how people were chasing the, 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 the full and needs Foot soldiers, I don't call them military. They, they are foot soldiers, they are terrorists in uniform. Now you begin to understand. They are terrorists in uniform. And what I want you people to just look deep into, you will see there is no media room. It's BBC, the real BBC, they are saying that we are causing problems. BBC that came to shut my page down, the page that I'm managing, they think that they will shut me up. I have told them, my name is Consistency. Our second name on IP in IPOB is Consistency. I can never stop. If you like, go and shut all our page down. Uh, people are still watching us. Like I said, we have made ourselves figures on this social media. You see this social media? Thank God that social media is there. And like I said, we must destroy Nigeria with truth. There is no gun, there is no bullet. We are not going to shoot anybody. We are not going to kill them. But with the truth, we will finish them. Nigeria must be disintegrated. There is no two ways about it. Where is BBC? You see how people are doing protests, peaceful protests. This is the kind of protest that BBC is supposed to be there and begin to ask them, what is the problem? BBC will not ask them question. They will not even come there at all to know what is going on, to know the demand of the indigenous of that place. They, they will not ask. With small time now, you will see them, they will begin to write a nonsense, a fabricated stories or article, they call it. Now, you see, this thing that our people are doing, now, that means that our message is getting to our people. You see, we talk, people listen. And we have come we have been in that, you know, in that stage. We have come to liberate our people. We have come to tell our people what, what their problem is. Their problem is, number one, is the military. Those people you see that they are mounting roadblock in our place. They are not human beings. They are not human beings like me and you. These people are, they have mission. They have conquest. Abia states, you people, now you know, I trust Abia state, Abia state, Abia state, last. This is exactly what is going to happen in Anambra. Anambra, where I come from, I this is where I come from. Governor Soludo, the governor of Anambra State today, you have to share. You see all those roadblocks in our, we don't need it. We don't need it. These people are killing us slowly. These people are extorting money from us. The money that they will use for their conquest because they are using all this money to get, to get themselves weapon, sophisticated rifles, or assorted, you know, anything that they can lay their hand upon. Both jackknife, everything, match it. They are using our money to buy it. And we don't need it. We don't need it. I'm sending also this message to Prof. Shah Soludo, the governor of Anambra State. That is where I come from. I am from Eala. I'm sending this message also to Soludo. Soludo, we don't need any. You see this, all this roadblock. We don't need them. Now other states have forwarded themselves. 
I trust them because they know they carry last. I just said they never carry last. And they, I know, and I'm right, all the whole state in Biafra land, they have to chase all of them away. Chase them. They are the, 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 the number one problem. And the second one is BBC because there's no, you cannot find them. They are the number one mis disinformation, disinformation message, or, the, or, or their propaganda is everywhere. They have chased them away. BBC is not operating again in Asia. It's only in Africa. Now you begin to understand it. Write down, my people. This is peaceful one. Peaceful, peaceful. No guns, no bullet. Just pursue them. Pursue them. We don't need them. I thank you, people. On the here, we go to come here, come to tell on what they happen. You know, I still remember the Biafran child. Watching like a We are still on rapture media. Where we tell you the raw, where we bring you the details so that you will understand where your problem is. Good day and welcome.